Alright guys, so welcome back. Um, I just wanted to make an, a quick video about 10 things that I love about my 2009 Chevy Silverado. So yeah, without further ado, let's get to it. So, the first thing that I love about my truck is first and foremost, if I can open this hood because it's very hot, hot is the power plant. This is a 4.8 liter V8. For those who don't believe me, 4.8s come with two 43 heads. So you can see the casting number right there. Yeah, so I love this 4.8. Um, I've kept up with 4.8s and 5.3s. I haven't raced any 6.0s or 6.2s. Wait, I did race Jacob's 6.2, but no cap. <laughs> Those things run even with no tune. So yeah. So the first thing I love is this 4.8. The second thing that I love is doing the HD front end on these 07 to 13 or 14 Silverados. So if y'all have seen my videos way before, you know that I have the stock grill and the stock hood and no bumper caps. I will be doing the HD bumper soon, but not right now. But I just love how this truck looks. It looks way different than before. Um, it looked ugly with those black headlights thank god that i switched them out but but just these hd front ends on these trucks just look so better um yeah um so the third thing that i love about this truck is just the body style like like i don't know it just looks so well don't mind the the little bump that i have right there but I just love how this truck looks like, even like even if it was stock, I still love how this truck looks, the body lines, the curves, everything. All this, this shit right here, I love it, man. This truck, this and the step sides are probably my favorite year model Silverados and also the 2018s. Those are, those are like my top three. So I love how this truck looks. I know it's not dropped or anything, but to me, it looks good as is, but I will drop this truck really soon, guys. And the fourth thing that I love about this truck, and and this will be the same thing as the first one is the 4.8. I love the sound of this 4.8 with long tube headers. So let's turn this thing on real quick. that I love about this truck is the interior like like not how flimsy it is we will make a second video about what I do not like about this truck but I love how simple the interior looks but to me it looks good I like it and I don't like it but I just love how simple it is like any part on these trucks is basically um, interchangeable like like if any of my old friends remember, I I didn't have this uh, cluster. I switched it out, and this it it completely changed the the truck. Like yeah, it's a base model. It's not nothing fancy or anything, you know. But I try to keep my interior as clean as as clean as I possibly can, you know. But we'll get to another video about what things I do not like about this truck, and I have a and I have some big things that I do not like. So yeah. The seventh, or I think it's 67, I don't remember. Uh, man, I lost count. But uh, the sixth thing that I like about this truck is the back end. Like, come on, man. This truck looks so good. Like, I can't even imagine. This 
truck looks really good. And this is why that I chose this model year. I'm thinking about getting a step side really soon or a 2018, but that, but as of right now, I'm broke as hell. But I really do want to get those soon. The seventh thing that I like about my truck is is this is this will be the same reason as my first my first um my first option is this these trucks are so easy to modify like this quarter intake if y'all seen this video oh that is hot i got this thing for 50 bucks on ebay and also these headers i got them for 220 uh MSD plug wires with NGK TR5s. I got them both for 70 bucks, you know? I mean, I mean these these trucks in general, the the third gen, the fourth gen, all these trucks are so easy to modify. They're so easy and just just really simple bolt-ons will make this thing run like hell. Um also camming this thing. I haven't done it. I want to do it real soon, but I've seen it, it looks pretty easy, but I don't know. I do not have the DOD delete, so I guess it'll be much more easier for me. Just swap my lifters, my cam, push rods, valves, my, I think that's it, the valve seals. So yeah. The thing that, that I like about this truck is, as many of you don't know, I bought this thing like about three to four years ago, maybe five. Um, I got this thing with 35,000 miles on it. And right now, after these five years, let me check. It has 128,387 miles. I mean, that's not bad. It could be worse, but that's not bad. Um, I drove this thing everywhere to Austin, to I think Dallas. Uh, really, it's, it's not bad. I don't drive the truck anymore since I drive this. And for those who were wondering about whenever I installed these headers, turns out it was my cat. So this thing is my, my daily driver to work now. So. I don't have to worry about getting this thing stolen or whatever. So, yeah, but for having 128,000 miles, it runs pretty damn well. So nowadays you can come buy these trucks for like at least seven to eight thousand dollars with modifications. I got this thing for around twenty-five thousand dollars. Well, obviously it had low miles and interest and da 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 and all that, all that crap that no one likes. I could have found it for way cheaper somewhere else, but I love this truck, so yeah. The ninth thing I love about this truck is the color. Like, I don't know if you can see, I can't see, but it sparkles in the sun. This thing, if it's washed right, it'll glow in, in the sun, even though it's dirty as hell right now. But I love the paint choices that GM with went with these trucks. Even though GM was bankrupt, I think in 2007, 2008. I don't remember, I could be wrong, I'll look it up. I love, 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 love this truck. And the final thing that I like about this truck is just the stance. After this thing has like a, like a two inch or a three inch drop. Like, this thing isn't even dropped, and to me, it just looks aggressive. Like, after just a level drop, it looks really good. I'm doing a 5, a 5A drop on this truck. I have the flip kit. Uh, I'm just trying to save up for the, uh, for the uh, control arms, and then I won't have any camber in the front. I will do a, I, I will do a C notch in the back. Right, guys, these are my 10 or 11 things that I might have might have already named on the truck. But yeah, um, overall, I just love this truck. I will make another video on things I do not like about this truck. So yeah, uh, yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, share, and I'll catch y'all later.